There are those who look into the eyes of another and see opportunity. A soul to corrupt and twist. Their stories are the ones we fear. And there are those who see potential. The light within the soul. A chance to lift someone up to achieve the impossible. Their stories rise to legend. So tell me, what do you see in Quill? Because her story depends on you. those who look into the eyes of another and see opportunity a soul to corrupt and twist their stories are the ones we fear and there are those who see potential the light within the soul a chance to lift someone up to achieve the impossible their stories rise to legend. So tell me, what do you see in Quill? Because her story depends on you. those who look into the eyes of another and see opportunity a soul to corrupt and twist their stories are the ones we fear and there are those who see potential the light within the soul a chance to lift someone up to achieve the impossible their stories rise to legend. So tell me, what do you see in Quill? Because her story depends on you.
Hello, hello. Uh, I'm Chris, this is Gross Models, and this is Katie. Hello. And we are playing, well, Katie's playing, I'm just watching and, you know, helping. That's Maybe the word, not helping. helping. I'm, I'm very helpful. We're helping, we're playing Moss Book 2, uh, the continuing saga of Quill, the little tiny mouse person who's uh, off exploring things and doing stuff. And, um, yeah, um, I don't remember. We're just exploring the castle, really, aren't we? We've not really got an overarching objective. No, because we did the fairy one. Yeah, but what's the, the whole point of the game? There isn't really a thing, is there? It's just Finding uh, the, the glass or thingies and putting them all together. Oh, OK. Something sort of, to do with that. Yeah, it's, it's like that. the first one was sort of rescuing your uncle, wasn't it? But he, we rescued him and then he sort of ran away. But, uh, yeah. So Quill, the mouse, is down there. If Katie can look down a little bit more at uh, her, that'd be helpful. Thank you. So, uh, yeah, uh, we did the big green thing that was a big, massive level last time. Uh, so now we're going to progress through the door that did have a red force field across it, but we've got rid of that now. Uh, Steve131 was the first one in the chat, uh, as is Gemma and Mark now watching. So if you're watching and not in the live chat, come along and join in, because apart from anything else, we might need your help. Um, so, yes, uh, we're planning on playing for an hour or so tonight, assuming that there's a convenient stopping point about there, or just before there, if it ends up that way. So, uh, we'll, we'll get on with it. I need to open the door. We've got to go through that big door over there, so Casey's got to lean forward and not fall over. To so actually reach it and grab it. Tell me if I'm going to hit anything, OK? Well, you, it's just changed colour, so you can probably grab it from there. There we go. Oh, it's blue! Mountains. Okay, mountain side, that's where we're going. How do I get up there? Don't want to jump. There you go. Oh, it's a castle. It's blue. Go through the blue watery thing. Quill stopped. You told me to stay not on water. Something didn't seem right. It was like the toad said. There was far more going on than she understood. She'd be empty handed. But Quill knew she had to return to the chamber to talk with her uncle before going any farther. Oh, well, there you go. We're not going in there yet. <laughs> uh, as ever, of course, if you're watching, do let me know that the audio and video is working as it should. I, I think is it, it should that way? Be. I believe so. It's been a long time. It's only been a week. This is where he was. Don't know where he is now, though. Might be down here. Um. Bird. Oh my god. Is Object. it a friendly? Is it a friendly bird? I doubt it. Ah! I would think not. Wow, I mean, it's stolen your green thing. Oh. Found my uncle though. Wait, it's got two of them. It stole them. No. It killed me. I don't think coming back to this room was a good idea. There's a lot of water here. <gasps> Quill got her feet wet, didn't drown. It's not so good. Your uncle, go, go and help your uncle quick. Bad foot, yeah. Bad foot, or he is hurt as well, I think. This isn't a happy episode. Some very sad music. Mark says, oops. I 
don't think tickles are going to help. I was striking it better. I'm so very sorry, Reader. We've never seen a bond as strong as the one between you and Quill. What just happened? And seeing it broken... ...breaks us all. What? But you're still here, Reader. And you're our last hope. I'm so confused. With the Owl Tylen now in possession of Four Glass, there's only one left that evades him. Should he claim it, the world as we know it will end. Oh, different book. Wait, did Quill die? Didn't think so. But, but the... the fate of Moss now lies in a tale that has turned quite cold to its readers. But it's here where the last glass resides. Long ago, a single creature held all five glass, and their reader became a god. You see, a reader with one glass can be a part of the story, but a reader with all five glass unlocks the means to rewrite the books of Moss, to author fate itself. And this reader had hate in their heart. Ah. Twofold became torched. The poor creature's will lost to the reader's own, and the world of Moss suffered a great unmaking. The snow's making me feel cold. Well, the, the reader's evil. Don't be evil. But I'm the good evil. creatures of Moss no. united don't together, don't. seized the glass, and cast its omnipotent reader from their world forever. That any mortal survived that time was nothing short of a miracle. As time passed, champions rose and fell. Peace, however fragile, didn't come until the truce. The glass was divided between five realms, each vowing never to combine it again. But stories retold tend to fade with age. And history too often repeats. This is me, the green one. Well, no, I think this is back in the past, so. Oh. That's yeah. what I see when I. Can I'm... you look down a little bit further? That's what I can see. Only see the top half of the book. That's what I see when we look yeah. in the reflection. The well, green one. I think one. you're a new version of it, but. Which brings us to the Owl Tylen, who thought himself wise beyond all the creatures of Moss. Forsaken by his own for this hubris, Tylen found kinship with another outcast, a meddling starving named Adurin. Like all starvings, Adurin was immortal, but he loved the mess of mortality how in their blink of life, mortals needed one another. So, anxious to impress his new friend, he helped Tylen steal his first glass from a realm mm. grown complacent. Such an act was ruled a crime among the Starthing's own, with a punishment Adurin refused to accept he was cursed to become that which he loved most. Mortal. And in 100 years and a day, he would die his final death. Desperate, Adurin revealed to Tylen the power of the five glass combined. Adurin hoped his twofold friend could use it to undo his own damnation. Tylen hungered to hold such domain. And so they stole another. 
then forged an army to steal it all. All right, that's where all the bad people came from. Mm -hmm. uh, Wayne Ward's here, saying uh, he's loving this. Welcome and thank you. We'll get to the actual game in a minute. <laughs> then came Maybe. the Cinder Knight. The night they would claim all five glass. But they failed. And enraged whispers befell Tylan's ears. A Durin sabotaged us. Several times with that cursed starving. Let him die. And the owl obeyed. Since then, Tylan has hexed and hunted every corner of Moss, and now only one glass eludes him. Lucky for us, the one who holds it hides herself well. But she vowed long ago never to answer the call of a reader. Okay, so this is someone other than Quill. So Nothing made Sahima's weary blood boil more than the starving Adurin and his endless tricks. She tried to ignore him, but he kept rambling on about a twofold champion who'd killed the serpent Sarfog. I told you last time, if I saw you again, I'd kill you. Oh, don't cook him. Ghostface? But well, where's the kid? Not again, thought the king. She'd been haunted by these monstrous readers her whole me. life. Why me? Why me? This wasn't the plan. That lady tried to kill me. It seemed that way, didn't it? Oh my god, it's cold. Ghosties in the snow. Quills are no show. But where the glass go? If that makes your glass the last, then I'll be right back. Good riddance, thought Sahima as she watched the starving buzz off. But now she needed to shake this vile reader. You got up here before her. Uh Oh, she's tired. It's a big climb. It was no use. There was no escaping this one. You're not welcome here, reader. I work alone. It's only got very dark. Chills spread down Sahima's spine. <gasps> Tylan and the Arcane were tearing Moss apart. Oh no. It reminded her of the Cinder Knight. Maybe worse. There would be no hiding. They'd be coming for her soon enough. She had to fight. Even if that meant playing into this reader's hands. Yeah, I can control you now. Okay, so we're now somebody else. We're now this one. Okay. She doesn't like us, though. Can you attack things? I assume you haven't got a sword, but... Oh, you've got that... Throw, like is it... Throwing disc, boomerang thingy? Some sort of... yeah. That's interesting. I'm guessing I have to go up there. Yeah, I'm guessing that thing to the left of it you've got to hit with a thing to, you know, 
Just about to turn off the shield thing. I'm assuming she throws that whichever direction she's facing. She's, she's getting bored, she's telling you where to go. Doesn't go very far, does it? Okay. Ah, right. Power it up like you can power up the other thing. Mm -hmm. Bet she can't do the quick jump though. This day just keeps getting better. Sahima grumbled to herself. <gasps> the arcane were oh, closer God, than bomb. ever. She'd need what? to work fast. I'm scared. Where are you? I'm down here. I'm oh, home. Right, okay. I couldn't see down there. Or anything. I killed it. Sort of easing you into combat gently again, isn't it? Did you have two of them then? Possibly. Yeah, I think I have two left. Oh. Right away, you haven't got healed yet. Died. Yeah, that uh, healing didn't take. I don't think you did it quite. That easing you back in to combat gently definitely worked, didn't Katie, it? Katie, can you try and keep your character in our view, says your mum. You're looking up a bit too I high. I can try, so. but I don't know when I'm in your view. Well, basically, if you think about the middle of what you can see, that's the middle of what we can see, so. Ow. Need to get so close when you're attacking them with the boomerangy things because you throw them. I want to make sure I don't miss. Oh, if you miss, it's not a big deal, though, is it? It's going away. I did it. Steve Run31 says evening again. He said evening earlier, but you know, it's only evening again. He obviously came in, then went away and come back. things to smash up there. And the boomerangs are definitely not as strong as Quill's sword. No. But they do have the advantage. Still can't swim though. <sighs> it was on ice. I thought I could walk on ice. I can't. I'm guessing no would be the answer to that. I'm assuming you can't move that yet can't until move you smash that the until I do thing. that, but I can't figure out how to get there because I don't think I can make it to here. Well, you might. <gasps> Should I try it? Don't huff at me if I fall in the water again, okay? <gasps> it looks like you can land on it once or twice, but the second time breaks it. Yeah, I'll just try and run across it. Uh, Steve says you're right. Give yep, me a yep. slow clap. Yeah, okay. 
Well, that didn't work. Oh, that's interesting. But I need hmm. it to be higher than that. I need it to be higher up. But you need to jump over there. Showing off now. Oh. Can you hit that thing that tree? Interesting. Does that? Yeah, I don't think that works. No. But it definitely does something. I reckon you have to stand on top of the the box that you can't move yet, and then hit the thing. No, but she told me to go that way. Yeah, but I don't think she meant it. You think she was lying? Well, I may be mistaken. No, I don't want to be up there. Alright, don't stay. F from there. Let me heal, because yeah, that hurt me. Maybe from here. Can you hit the thing well, from I there? Well, I go from here, but go do There's a post in the way, isn't there? I can't quite tell from here. No, it might be okay. I'm too high. Yeah, it's too high. But that isn't... I don't understand. It's like to do with this. Yeah. Can you... If you pull it back out, does that just pull it back out? I'm confused. It's definitely been some sort of target there, isn't it? But you can't jump onto that. No. I don't know. I can't tell. What else can you do? Can you fire another one, or is that the same button that pulls it back? That's what brings it back. I'm not sure. I, I'll go back to the previous area a minute. Ah, no, that's it. It comes back to you. Yeah. So put it in that wall. Oh, and then come over to and here. And then come over there, yeah. You can get it by rebound, as it were. I've got it. There we go. Yeah, because it comes back straight to you. And it shows you where it's going to hit. So, that'll do it. Cool. Ah, breach. Alright, there you go. New game mechanic we've just learnt. What are I hated using this path? Mines. It was here where she You're promised her mother she'd protect the glass with her life. And never let a reader tempt her. The vow she intended to keep. He got up there. Hmm. Well, you got to blow the thing up. No doubt. Blow what thing up? Well, the, the thing next to it. Yeah. The thing that you've been blowing up. Yeah, that's what I was pointing at. Oh, I thought you were pointing at the big round thing. No, I just need to figure out how to get high okay. enough. I, I, again, there. being that we can't see it in 3D, we're a bit behind you. Ah. So, uh, I can't quite tell what you can climb. Ah, can you climb up that thing to the left? This? Yeah. No. No? I thought that's about the right height for... I can get this first no, bit, okay. that's it. What, what's any further? No. Oh, there's a cliff up to the left is a path, isn't it? Is that where I came from? I don't know. We can't see anymore because you're not looking at yourself. I can't see. I don't want to go that way. I don't think well, I'm. I think you've got to go that way because you can't no, go I've the other way. No, I've got to go that way because I'm going towards the castle. Yeah, but you can't go that way at the moment. So go the other way. I can see the elbow thing <laughs> this way. Apart from anything else, if you go the other way, you might find a secret. Two. Keep on the path. You get cold feet. I'm already cold. This is where I came from. Ah, oh, right. Okay. I didn't realise that. So then I want to go down then. Is there another I want to go this down? way I can, then. I can't tell. Wait, where am I? 
I'm gonna go this way then. Okay. Uh, well, there you go. Yeah, because now I can stand on there to get to that. Right. Maybe. Maybe not, because I need mm, to get to there. But I need... <laughs> yeah, that's you need to break that one to get to the scroll. Mm -hmm. But I need to break that so can I you can go get to up. the right bit. Is that a? Ooh, oh, that's, that's a very a... thingy. Ah, you've still got that power. There you go. That's because that's your power rather than that's Quill's power. That's my power, not Quill power. Oh, yeah. I'm wondering what you're looking at, Minnie. Is he going to attack me? I don't know. He seems yeah, all right at the moment. Rabbit. But rabbit eat mice. If I jumped, it might have worked. Yeah, nice idea, but no. Well, then how do I get to that one? And now I'm stuck. Oh, you're going to go down and through the tunnel again. I think you can get, uh, maybe from that platform, you can get both of them. I don't know. Well, yeah, but I need to get to that platform. Yeah, well, first. you didn't Which means I need to get up there up yet. You fell down when you were busy. So, go back through the tunnel. Go to the up left, this way. upstairs. Well, you've got a couple of barrels back there as well. It wouldn't let me break that one, so oh. I gave up with that. Two in the background. I didn't go that way. No, uh, I know. Don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off. Woke the rabbit up. But look how careful I was walking along there. Quite careful, yeah. Quill wouldn't walk that careful. Uh, I think she probably would. I don't think so. Yeah, I'll go up the top there while you're here. But what if something attacks me? Then you defend yourself with extreme prejudice. What? Hit with your spinny things. No, I'll just run away and hide. I give up, I can't break that one. Where are you? I'm up here. Oh, you're up there, alright. I got momentarily lost. Yeah, I couldn't see you either. Wait, because so. now I can do this one. <laughs> Doing this way. What? I'm not even paying. What? So she's not looking that way. Got not got to be looking completely towards it. It's better. It's not a thing, right? I think you should go back and get that uh, thing. Scroll. That's it. And then um, work your way back up again, back up to the top where you are next to the top of the thing. Well, up where? Up next to the top of that big barrel thing that you just unlocked. Up that way? Uh, no, back up through the tunnel again. Wait. Across the bridge. Oh, well maybe you could do it from here. <laughs> okay, back where you came from then.
big spinning wheel. There was a thing on the front of that. Of what? This. I don't know, turn it around a bit more. There. Out for the bombs. Yeah, I'm going to try and do it without knocking any of them. Whoops. Yeah, don't worry about it. You have to be pretty close for it to hurt. No, I don't want to go down there. Yes, you do. No, well, I you don't. haven't got much choice. That's a cannon thing, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, and there's three gate doorway thingies. Yeah. Yeah, but how do I get up there? You gotta go down, aren't you? No, because there's still nothing to get up there. Mm. I reckon I gotta go up here. I didn't even see that there wasn't up there. Yeah, there's a white wall to the right there. If you go along to the right a bit further and then jump up. There you go. There we go. Lever, open the portcullis, probably. Now you've got to go down there. <laughs> so close. So close. I don't like the colour of that one. I feel like it's going to attack. Watch out for the thing that you let go of at the top. I know. Dying. Yeah, you've got to hit the cup of kick off. Yeah. More coming. Can you look down a bit more because you can't see our yeah. screen. <gasps> Not safe. 
I think you turn him around so you can get to the guy behind it. Turn here around this one. Yeah, you've got to hit the one behind. Don't matter what you're shooting at, just go and hit the guy that's pushing it around. Or maybe you can shoot him, I don't know. I'm not sure that's hurt now. It might be. I think it is. Okay, then you're gonna have to go and do them by hand though. Definitely getting better at the combat thing. See what practice does? She doesn't give high fives, though. Quill <laughs> gives high fives. No, she doesn't really like you very much. Quill would have given me a high five. Quill would have given you a high five, yeah. Look at them break the castle. Well done, Katie. Keep it up, says Mark. Thank you. It's like the icy castle, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> To let it go. <sighs> no. No, I'm uh, going to be attacked again. Gemma says, "Well done as well." Sahima uh, was shocked to find the arcane hex on the castle door gone. Maybe this Quill champion is leading a resistance. Yeah. She thought. Sahima needed to find her and figure it out. Wait, so Quill isn't dead? Quill's not <gasps> dead. The, the grandfather was yeah. dead or hurt badly. I landed, I jumped onto the top of the top fence. Top of the fence. <laughs> <laughs> I can turn this, so I don't know if there's something, a door thingy here as well. Yep. But I think I need to hit this. Definitely need to hit that. And I don't um, know. There's one at the top there as well, and a button. But I don't know how to get to any of them. And this once this will turn. Well, not yet. Not yet, but it will turn. But I don't know how to get to any of it. No. So you can climb up that. Up what? This one. Just to the left. Yeah. But what good does that do me? It'll get you up the top again. I need to get to this. Can you climb up halfway and jump off to the left? No, I, I go through works. here. Go through there, yeah, through the ice, into the drowny pole. There was no ice there, it went straight to the water. So how am I meant to... I need to go this way then. I need to get it going here. Ah, so Don't I can put it underwater though, because that would be bad. Jump straight in. There we go. And then I go up here. What do you think that's going to do? Oh, that'll open that. Right. I'm scared now, so I might get me. You've got to shoot things with it. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to use it to shoot that one. Yep. You've got to shoot the other one, are you? I'm going to try. What happens if you turn the thing around? What happens if it turn? No, I can't shoot them. I'm... what, this? Yeah. Oh, that's a sticky thing. That's where you got to stick your thing to. And then turn it around a bit more so you can pull it out onto the other thing. No, not that. I was curious. Your sticky boomerang. But I can't get up there, can I? Uh, so how do I get up there? That's a question. I know it's... Wait, I know what to do. I know what to do. 
Okay. I need to keep hold of this because I feel like I'm going to get attacked otherwise. Probably. You talk to us what you got to do. i got to go up here. Because I'm forgetting about the battles. If I go here, I can go on top of here. Right. <gasps> and then turn this a bit. Oh, right. Is that enough, is it? Maybe. It's worth a try. Yeah. Yeah. But you can't release it from here. You need to be. Ah. No, but, yeah, about there, but you need I to gotta be down, be down, down here. Barrel. Yeah, okay. So now I come back down. Da! There you go. They wait, this is. What? Have I, I still know. got another one? You've obviously got to go there, though. Then you can go up the stairs. Is there a... There must be a passageway. Ah! I found missed it. it. <laughs> um... What did it do? I don't know. Look around. It must have done something. It's turning something. Wait! Watch. So far around it goes. All oh, right, open another door. There's a thingy in here. All right, okay. So how are you going to smash that? I'm going to try and turn this the other way around. And then I bring this over here. down and across again as long as you don't fall in the ice. Nice, well done. No, ice, not nice. Ice, well done. This is the door you used to get in. Uh, before you go through the door, go to your left. There's going to be something hidden in there, isn't there? Maybe just the stuff. No, there's nothing hidden at all. Well, there's the the, the uh, little fruity stuff. Open it now? I think so. Is this going out where you came from? It looks like where you came from, wasn't it? I nearly got a high five. <laughs> all I want is a high five. She says no. No. Alright, so yeah, this is the door that you opened already from this side. Yeah, I wasn't allowed to go so to So now there, you've got to go and find Quill. I don't know how to find Quill. But got knocked down the thing, didn't you? Wait, it's all gone green again. There you are! A Durin sprung maniacally got, from got the castle down there depths. Somewhere. Yeah. Quill's down there! Somewhere. Follow me. Put the pink thing there. Great. Sahima grimaced at the sight of the starling. I should have expected to find you here. So what? I go down there and you buzz off and then all the real trouble comes? Get the message, bugger. No one wants you here. If I were you, I'd be nicer to me. Just find her already. Sahima hated to do anything close to what Adurin wanted. For all I know, this could be an elaborate trap set by that wretched starving. She thought. But if the champion who slayed Sarfog was really in the castle depths, Together, maybe they could fix all this. Look, the windows show the thingies that have been the skull things collected. Mm. There's none of those two. They're just empty. So do I you gotta jump down here? I 
think so. <laughs> Maybe not. I don't know, it killed one of the two people that jumped down there. I wouldn't jump down there anymore. Maybe that way, because look, it's pink. Have a look down closer around. There's not any path down, is there? No. No, but this is down. Oh, there's a thing to smash. Where? Well, the uh, the purple thing. Oh, the pink thing, yeah, that's pink where thing, I'm yeah. going. Okay. Because we wouldn't have been able to do that before, have we? I haven't even seen it before, but I'm going to go down here. Yeah. Because that's going downwards. Okay, uh, do we want to stop now? This is, seems like a good place to stop. We might be starting another big chapter. Yeah, let's stop. So if we call it a night here, then next week we can start with this bit. No. She says no, leave her alone. So, uh, yeah, we're going to call it a night there then. So we shall return next week? Yeah. Yeah, next week we shall return at 8pm and do the next half of this chapter or whatever. Uh, we'll play again for another hour or so. Ice work, says Mark. Yeah. Nice work, Katie. Thank you. Uh, so, yes, thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you're enjoying it, tell your friends. Come along and watch next week when we'll be doing more of the same and uh, see how much further through we can get. So, thank you very much, for Katie, for playing. Thank, uh, you. thank you very much, everyone, for watching. And we shall see you soon. Bye. Uh, yeah. Bye bye for now. <laughs>